the WGAL News 8 Storm Team forecast with meteorologist TJ Springer. I feel like we haven't seen the sunshine in so long. We had the dreariness earlier on in the week, caught a little break, saw some sun, then it came right back. But look, it is so great to see it beaming in the capital city as we're taking that live glance off to the north and west. If you are heading out this evening, you shouldn't have any issues. You may want to bring a light jacket, though. That's something you want to plan on because temperatures with the help of the clearing sky are going to drop off pretty quickly. Still some clouds though mixed with that sunshine in the capital and eventually we are going to be seeing more clearing through dinner time and really through the overnight super Doppler rate showing a lot more sunshine out to our west. So some clouds on top of uh, Lancaster though with more out to the east as this upper level disturbance is uh, continuing to move away. Now as we progress through the rest of the weekend, this system should be moving eastbound, the same one that brought us the dreariness yesterday. All that heavy rain, of course, up into portions of New York and Jersey. Still spinning offshore, but we are expecting a nice stretch of weather as high pressure starts to settle in later on tomorrow into the start of this coming work week. Through the remainder of the evening, we'll drop back off into the 60s. The breeze will be lightening up. It'll be comfy, but again, may want a light jacket. Then through the overnight, we'll fall back into the middle and upper 50s with the clearing and that lighter breeze could have some patchy fall developing, especially in the valleys. And then as we progress through tomorrow, we're right back into the 70s near 80 in some spots. Plenty of sunshine, low humidity, really a gorgeous day to get outside if you have any plans to do so. We had 76 today, which is back above normal. Finally, we've been so below for much of the week. Our low was 61 this morning, which is actually a little above normal as well. That average low for this time of the year is 53 with no rainfall recorded for our Saturday, at least in the uh, capital city. And that goes really for most of us, I would think. 72 is the current temperature in Lewistown, 75 in Chambersburg. We have 71 at both Lancaster and Lebanon. Notice where the clouds are still hanging on. It's a little cooler. We have uh, nearly 80 degrees in Carlisle, a bit warmer there, and tomorrow looks great. Still going to have temperatures above normal. Really, the, today was the start of the warming trend for us. We'll have temperatures near 80 degrees if you're getting out to Happy Hauntings. Starts at noon, goes through 8 o'clock. Again, may want a light jacket just in case or a hoodie as temperatures start to drop off pretty quickly back towards 70, if not getting into the upper 60s. Of course, we're expecting a really great game in Lincoln Financial tomorrow. 70s yet again. We'll have temperatures nearly at 80 for the second half as the Eagles take on the uh, Washington Commanders that game at uh, 1 o'clock. Timing things out on Prichter. You can see those clouds exiting as high pressure starts to build on them in that uh, upper level low is moving away and really a nice night for us, but a cool night. You can see some of the outlying areas possibly getting even cooler, possibly into the uh, lower 50s. And as we head through tomorrow morning, we're warming quickly with that northerly breeze dragging in that pleasant feeling air mass back close to 80 for the afternoon. And really, this is just the start of it as we're expecting even warmer temperatures as we head into early next week. It's all thanks to this upper level ridge, this area of high pressure higher upstairs in the atmosphere going to park itself right on top of us here across the mid-Atlantic and the northeast leading to warmth. But another system going to move in later in the week and by Friday, that's what we're tracking. Not only is it going to bring some rain, but we're going to get a pretty cool shot of air too as we head into uh, the latter portion of uh, next week in the early uh, next weekend. I should say we are expecting temperatures to get back into the uh, 60s back below normal after getting back into the low 80s from Tuesday really onward to Thursday. Plenty of sunshine, but as that ridge breaks down, there goes that uh, chance of rain and that's going to bring us uh, kind of an unsettled stretch that storm system. And once that gets through, then we're back into the 60s with lows in the 40s. It's going to feel a lot more like uh, fall, Jerry, kind of like what we had earlier on this week. So I think it's going to be uh, Another day where we could get those uh, hoodies and sweatshirts out. <laughs> we love the fall mm. feels.